this, my second lesson. Uh, so Far Away by Avenged Sevenfold. Good band, good song. Um, yeah, this is how it goes. Right, so the first chord is an E minor, which is um, the open lowest string, the open E string. This one, uh, yeah. Second fret on the second string. Second fret on the third string. E A D. Uh, open G. Open B. Open E. Sorry about the numbers I used for the uh, strings there. I got them the wrong way round. First string's this one, six string's this one. This one's not first. Okay, sorry, got that the wrong way round. Anyways, so that's E minor. Can you hit that? So you hear that, that? So it's down. Down, up. Down, up, down, up. And again. Down, up, down, and then for the up, you change to a G major, which is third on the first, third on the second, open third, open fourth, second on the fifth, and third on the sixth. So looking at it from bottom to top is three, two, zero, zero, three, three. So that's. D. Now I leave the A string open for this, it just makes it sound a bit thicker, um, you don't have to, and usually if you see a D chord written down it is just the bottom four strings, for one, two, three and four, but I put the A string in there because it's the same note as this one on the G string, and together it sounds like this, instead of, so it just sounds a bit bigger, I just prefer it. So that's on the first string, the second fret, third fret on the second string, second fret on the third string, open fourth, oh, open fifth. It's all together so far. go to a B minor, um, you don't have to bar this because I can't hear the highest B, uh, B. Um, that would be a F sharp, but anyways, um, I don't hear that on the record, so I don't play that, but I suppose you can bar it if you want the, the whole chord in there. I tend not to, and so I play uh, second on the A, fourth on the D and G, and third on the B. And I hit that twice and go to a C major, which is third on the A, second on the D, open G, first on the B, open E. And that's the whole of the first um, kind of riff, I suppose it'd be. play it again and then you go to what would be kind of a B power chord on the second fret of the A so that's um, two and four but you also play all the rest of the strings open um, this is some sort of variant of an E minor chord uh, I'm not entirely sure what it's called I'm sorry about the middle finger there <laughs> but you hit all those and it sounds it just sounds a bit different and they seem to use that on the recording so that's what you do. Um, so and then you carry on as normal to the G, D, B, C. And then going into the chorus, there's a kind of bridge which is um, C, D. And then he does the little which is, uh, I play that with these two fingers because the other fingers are holding down the chord uh, and that's third on the high E, second on the high E, open, back to second.
But if you do that with a whole chord, it's... Right, so it comes out as... Right, so now to the chorus, um, which is a bit of a complicated one. Um, still fairly simple, there's nothing that's really too difficult about it. Uh, there's four or five chords, I'd say. Um, you already know most of them. The only new one is an A minor, which is open A, second on the D, second on the G, first on the B, open E. Now, obviously, you may already know this chord, but just in case you don't, that's how you play it. And so you start like, should sound like that. So, anyways, for the chorus, it's an E minor. To a G, to the A minor, E minor twice, D, back to E minor, to the G again, A minor again, then C, and then D, and that's the chorus, so it should sound like this. back to the verse which we've already learned. Right, okay, well that just about wraps it up for this lesson. Um, hope you enjoyed it. So far away, Avenged Sevenfold. Um, if you want to see more lessons like this, please like, favourite, subscribe, comment, do whatever you like. Um, and uh, if there's any other songs you'd like to learn, similar to this or by any sort of band similar to Avenged Sevenfold, Avenged Sevenfold themselves, anyone, any song, um, I'm willing to teach it. Um, so just leave your comment uh, with song title and band or artist name uh, in the comment section. I'll teach it and obviously keep it within reason. <laughs> no Dragon Force please. But um, anything else, yeah. Um, I'll see what I can do. Uh, see you in my next lesson, and goodbye.